Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and today I'm gonna show you what to do if your Windows 10 or Windows 11 is running extremely slow. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to update your Windows operating system. This is very important because sometimes the latest updates will fix your issues. So press the Windows button, click on the settings icon, then head over to Windows Update on the left pane and then on the right side click on the blue check for updates button. Windows will now try to scan for the latest updates, download and install them automatically. Then you can check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to update your drivers. So to do this, right click the Windows button, now select Device Manager from the list of options and afterwards make sure to expand any problematic devices that will show up with an exclamation mark in here. So expand them, right click on them and then select Update Drive. Now click on search automatically for drivers and Windows will try to find the best available drivers on your PC. Then you can check if the problem still persists. Next in line you can also disable heavy performance processes. To do this right click the Windows button then select task manager from the list of options. And now in here if you have any process that looks quite problematic in terms of memory or CPU just right click on it and select the end task option. Then you can check if the problem still persists. Moving on you can also enable a faster startup option. So in order to do this press the windows button then simply type power plan. So just click on edit power plan from the search results and what you have to do now is click on power options right here and then select choose what the power buttons do on the left pane. Now what you have to do is click on change settings that are currently unavailable and then make sure that the turn on fast startup button is ticked on. Now just save your changes, restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. And lastly another useful solution is to perform a clean boot. To do this press the windows button type in msconfig and select system configuration from the search results. Now in here click on the services tab and tick the box next to hide all Microsoft services and then click on the disable all button. Afterwards head over to the startup tab and then open task manager. Now in here disable all the unnecessary apps that might be causing trouble with your performance and then make sure to close this window, click on apply and ok to save the changes and restart your computer to check if the problem still persists. And that's it, super simple isn't it? Of course if this video helped you make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more quality content. Thanks for watching.